Hello everybody and welcome to the ninth and final Viewpoints video. Today we finally combine all of the thinking that we've been doing over the last two months into one theatrical activity. Today's viewpoint is called kinesthetic response. That's a big word, uh, it's actually two words, and it can be difficult to get our head around because it just means responding to anything that's in the environment. For example, if someone came up behind me and went boo, I might go like that. That's a kinesthetic response. If the door slams behind me, I might go like this, which is a kinesthetic response. So you can see how kinesthetic response works. It's us responding to things that are happening in the world outside us. This is very, very important in theatre because all acting is just about reacting to the things that are going on around you. So what we're going to watch in a second is going to be Kristen and myself undertaking a kinesthetic response exercise. The instructions that we've been given are really simple. We can walk in a straight line ahead of us. We can start moving, stop moving, make a gesture that feels right, or say a couple of lines. What you will see happen is a relationship between these two characters slowly build in relation to the environment around them. What you will see in this exercise is the way that all of the different viewpoints that we've looked at, like architecture, body shape, gesture, pathways, and now kinesthetic response, interact with each other in order to create something that begins to look finished. It's not quite there. For those of you who enjoyed these viewpoints videos and have been following them along, when we are able to interact in person, we will put some of this kinesthetic response into action and use it to create an actual finished dance work. Take a look at the video with me and Kristen doing the activity. Just sit back, relax, and have a watch. It's a pretty long one. There's no exercise for you to do this week, because to do this exercise, we need to be in a room uh, with someone who can guide the activity, like myself. Okay, see you soon, and I hope you're all doing okay out there. I don't want to hear it. 